as Sarai's servant. She was not supposed to despise her mistress. She was not supposed to flee from her either. It was her fault. Based on this, God gave her the direction to go back to Sarai and submit to her. Here we learn of we learn God's way of helping people. That is to help them clarify their position and keep it. Let's say in your family you have certain conflict. Then God comes to your family and then tries to settle the matter. So what would God do? God would show you what you are. Your position. And then what you are supposed to do based on your position. And then God will say, do this and you'll be okay. And then the things you went beyond that, don't do that. Apologize. God will say that. And then the other person, God will do the same thing. This is God's way. God helps us to clarify our position and keep it. So many problems occur at work, at home, and even in the church. And many people suffer. All because some people went beyond their position and said what did what they were not supposed to say and do. That's what uh, Satan did, going beyond his position. And that's how Adam and Eve fell. And that's how today so many people become Satan's instruments at home, at work, and even in the church. So we need to really remember our position. What is my position? And then based on that, we can see what we can think of and say. And then what we can do. Other than that, don't do it. This is God's way. Those who fear God keep their position. But those who are rebellious don't care. So don't be those rebellious people. Think about how Judas Iscariot became Satan's instrument. At the Last Supper, when Jesus exposed his betrayal openly with a piece of bread, his response was not so good at all. He just grabbed it and just left, showing that when Jesus exposed his betrayal openly, he was really upset, angry. And then when he grabbed it and left the room, he was determined that he would bring harm on Jesus, revenge. That's how he became Satan's instrument. About that, the Bible says, Satan entered into him. That's how people become Satan's instruments. Never give in to that sense of frustration or anger or uh, uh, the, 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 you want to do some revenge on others. Never go that way. Instead, keep your position in your words and actions. Music